Well, the jig is up, the news is out. They finally found him burrowed in the sand on the west coast of South Africa. And you're probably wondering what I'm talking about. Well, ABC's Danny New will tell you. One of the cutest animals I've ever seen, and no one had seen it in nearly 90 years. You guys did rediscover this golden mole 86 years later. Absolutely. Cobus and Esther are two of the conservationists from South Africa's Endangered Wildlife Trust who had the mission of locating this seemingly extinct species called the DeWinton's Golden Mole. Endangered species and habitat is our, is our thing. But back when their team started looking around 2019, this golden mole proved quite tricky. It's blind, nocturnal, and most importantly, loves to burrow beneath sand. The sand basically collapses behind them as they move through the soil, which means the, the trails aren't always visible. I don't like sand. So that's when the team had to turn to its secret weapon. Release the hounds. Esther's best friend, Jesse. From when she was six months old, um, she was used for conservation. But because it's hard to recognize the scent of an animal that we haven't smelled in nearly a century, the team had to work backwards. Basically, when they found evidence of a habitat, Jessie would communicate if she smelled one of the known golden mole species. Until one day in 2021, when they came across a scent that Jessie did not recognize. It was quite, quite a big, big thing for the whole team. Once they found this adorable little golden pancake, they took samples, and the research was finally reviewed and confirmed just recently. Sadly, Jessie is no longer with us, but in a way, she always will be now. I feel it's great that she could leave a paw print on, on the world of conservation with her contributions to this project. That's a cool one. Well, and now the Endangered Wildlife Trust has many initiatives underway that are also utilizing dogs, and Cobus says that is also all thanks to Jessie.